This week Nathaniel and I are making Gurex, the Mediterranean dish very popular from Greece all the way around to Morocco. We're gonna finely chop an onion yeah. for the burek. I'll do the first half and you do the second half. Like a match. So, when you want to chop I mean, uh, an onion very finely, you keep the root. Okay. So that you go like this. And, it, and it's held. The onion is held at the top. It's as if you're making a flower. Yeah. Okay, and then you go as fine as possible. Can you see? Yeah. Okay, there we are. You hold the knife very, very firmly in your hand. Yeah. Very firmly. Yeah, don't go to the end. Get the tip of the knife further back. Yeah, that's it. Like that? Yeah. As thin as possible. It's hard, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, you know the theory. Yeah. I'll finish it. Right, we're gonna fry the meat for the burex now, which is minced meat. Okay, that's it, the pan is hot. We're gonna put about five meters. So, get yourself a wooden spoon, please try to uh, separate the meat. That's it, perfect. Hold the pan, handle, otherwise it will fly everywhere. Good stuff. So on a medium heat, we'll cook the meat first, halfway, and then we'll add the onion and the garlic and the spices. Okay. You want to learn how to do this? What you need to do yeah. is get all the stuff down to the bottom of the pan yeah. and go like this. Like this. Just imagine. Okay. Like a circle. Yeah. Hold the pan very firmly. Pitch further down, hold it up, hold the pan up, yeah, and then, and then yeah, yeah, you're getting better, wowzy wowzy, <laughs> yeah, that's it, bit by bit, like it's just practice, you know, yeah, we have a bit of time, like a little pinch of thyme, a uh, pinch of turmeric, you can use whatever you want, cumin, anything you want. This is a bit of garam masala, tiny bit, and then a mild chili but Do you like a bit of heat? <laughs> right, there we are, tiny bit of heat, and that's it, we leave it to cook further. <laughs> Take your time, yeah. There, see? Yeah. Well, no too much, because you need salt. <laughs> <laughs> we add uh, a bit of black pepper and some salt. Not too much. There we are. And this is ready now. We need to leave it to cool. Gonna miss it. We're going to end up with lots of washing Right, we need this to, to cool a bit. Show me how to how we do our parsley. Very good. Yeah, you're doing it, right? Perfect. Yeah, the parsley is for the burek. Yeah. Great. Uh, now we add the finishing touches. Finishing touches, one egg. Yeah. Fresh parsley and some boiled potatoes. Potatoes that we boiled and they're very soft. So what we do is just mix them in. Okay. They'll hold the meat together. So and this is the best bit. Very therapeutic. Okay. Really mix everything in. Yeah. Until the potatoes are melted in with the meat. Can you see it's like a lovely stuffing? Yeah. Tell you what, you have a go. It's wash your hands first. Let's see you smiling while you're doing it. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Yeah. Feels really good. 
So you mix the whole lot, make sure you don't drop it on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Sliding everywhere. And then once it's well mixed, we'll check the seasoning. Yeah. Uh, salt and pepper and things like that. And then we'll start making the burex. I'll show you the first one or two. Yeah. And then you do it. So what you do is spoonful yeah. the bottom. Okay. okay, near the end, and then we roll like this. Roll a couple of rolls first, and then we took it's like a, a pillow. There we are, and then we roll. Okay, piece of cake. They don't have to be the same. Perfect shape, we're not professionals. Yeah. Our boys here. Okay, you wanna yeah. try? Go on then. This is where it all works. No, I think you're gonna do better than me. Yep. Yeah. Tiny bit, yep. Yeah. Oh, I think you've cracked it. You know exactly what you're doing. Yeah. As you roll them, just tighten them a bit. Yeah. Tighten the meat. Press on the meat a little bit so that perfect. Oh, hey, what a professional there. <laughs> That's it, you've got the job. Yeah. Okay, uh, oil is hot enough to start frying. So, what you do is get a tiny bit yeah. and put it there. And so, when it starts like, you know, going mad like yeah. that, yeah. then you're all right. So, we have to be careful just like that. Yeah. I'll turn the heat down because they need to like just brown lightly. Yeah. Right. It is quite tricky, so be careful. Okay, you wanna do it? Absolutely. Yeah, all you need just put the, the end and drop it lightly. Perfect. It's cracked it. So the burex are ready. Everything is ready. Yeah, put them on some kitchen roll. To drain. All right, what we're serving the burek with is some mayonnaise with chives. Oh, you have to cook them very, very fine. Can you see? Surgery. Wow. Perfect. That's the way. And a bit of mild chili powder. What do you think? It? Yeah. A bit of. I think we've got enough chives there. Yeah. Touch of lemon juice. Oops, we've got a lemon tip in there. Why is it every time you squeeze the lemon, there's a so lemon tip? Fine. Okay, and then you, you mix it like that. Yeah. And we we'll serve them with the burex. That's it, cracked it. Touch of lemon. Squeeze. Hey, that's the pip. <laughs> Mm. Right, touch up. This is the mayonnaise that we made earlier on. You wanna try that? Yeah. Nice and crispy, yeah? Mm. What do you think? That's very nice. I'm gonna try one. <laughs> Sean, you like that? Yes, I would. Very hot. Mmm. Mm. That is nice. Mm. I haven't had any for a long, long time. time. Really nice. Mm -hmm. mm. Good stuff. That's it, we're done. Mm. If you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe for even more simple dishes to make at home. Thank you for watching.